Despite the rhetoric from animal activists like PETA, livestock producers are raising livestock in a safe and humane manner. When we have an outside group coming in to, to try and tell us how we should do it, um, when really their goal is just to eliminate animal agriculture, it gets to be very concerning. And he says animal activists use various means to destroy the industry. They've gone around um, to different states putting ballot initiatives up for votes where they ban the ability to put livestock into pens um, to put them inside of barns. However, the science supports these methods for humane livestock production. He says it's also frustrating when activists try to portray all producers as bad actors. What you have to realize is that at the end of the day, if I don't take care of my livestock, my livestock won't take care of me. In fact, Hadrick treats his livestock just like they're a member of his family. I need to make sure that they're comfortable. I need to make sure that they're well fed and in good health. And if I don't do that, I'm not going to be in business very long. This message is sponsored by the South Dakota Beef Chuckoff and the South Dakota Soybean Council.